and to ensure there are a lot of extremely broken skills that absolutely flip the world on its head, defying every law of nature and are extremely destructive. One of these skills are so dangerous it could even hurt the user if they aren't careful, but if we're trying to say what are the most broken skills in the series, we would have to start off with Rimuru's Void God Azatoth. Being created by CL, combining the ultimate skills Belzebuf and Raphael, the ultimate skills Veldora and Velger were also merged with it. It has the following strong skills. So Gluttony, a super enhanced version of Predation and Gluttony, which can devour the target's soul, ignoring space-time. Imaginary Collapse, otherly known as Turn No, which uses destructive energy stored in his stomach that defies all laws such as physics, magic, time, space, and etc. and destroys them. It's the ability Velda Nava used to create the world and is classified as the strongest ability being so powerful, it's only fully controllable with the use of Manus, and if used incorrectly, the user is susceptible to damage. Imaginary Space Spells of Youth, which is the enhanced version of its stomach, which is also called Chaos World. It's a prison with unlimited size where those who need to be quarantined are locked up. Vega Azatoth also has True Dragon release and a bit more, but next is Michael which is the highest rank angelic skill created by Veldanava. Its user is Rudra having the skills Armageddon which summons an army of up to 2 million angels which obey the user. Castle Guard which is an impenetrable barrier that can be activated by the user at will, powered by the loyalty of the user's subjects. While the barrier is active, the use of skills, magic kills, magic, and even aura are completely prohibited, leaving only purely physical and physiological means of attack available to the user such as sword playing hockey. Regalio's Dominion, it has the ability to place any life form under the user's will. Success is determined if the user's available energy is greater than the target's, with the only significant trade-off being that the captured target's total energy will be deducted from the user to maintain their control over them. As a result, the number of subjects that can be controlled at once is limited. The user can also access the skills of those under control. Its power is absolute control over any angelic skill holder achieved by sending signals of interference to the target's hardcore via minion circuits which is deeply embedded into all angelic skills and which are connected to Michael. The user has to be aware of the target's location via some means for this to work though. The user can freely use and duplicate after analysis the angelic skills of those under their control, with the degree of said control at their discretion. However, the effect can be resisted to some extent, especially if the subject has a demonic skill. Third on the list is Wisdom King Raphael, being one of Rimuru's current ultimate skills. It specializes in support, she even creates new skills, evolves them, and manages all his skills for him. It's basically like playing a game on auto and having a personal guide telling you everything you need to do or want to know. Basic rundown of all his skills is thought acceleration allows the user to speed up their thought process. Analytical appraisal is just to analyze things. Parallel calculation which allows multiple thought processes to happen at the same time without interfering the user's own thoughts. Chant annulment which allows the user to not have to chant anything when using magic. All the creation which allows the user to comprehend anything. Synthesize and separate, which is from the sacrifice of degenerate, which is the main component in upgrading and evolving skills, since it allows the user to separate and combine things. Lastly is future attack prediction, which allows the user to 100% guaranteed predict an attack that's going to happen. Next on the list is Shrub Nigraf, which is one of Rimuru's final ultimate skills, allowing the user to create brand new skills based on data. The data is based on its skill, skill storage, which stores the data of all analyzed skills so that they can be recreated later. It also allows him to recreate skills that have been fully analyzed, and also gifts skills to targets they are compatible with. Also on the list for the fifth slot, Milam has an extremely broken skill called Satanel. It has Magical Breeder Reactor, which is fueled by the user's rage and magic kills. By taking in magic kills from the surroundings and mixing them with their own, they then collide together in a process similar to nuclear fission and create more magic kills. This allows the user's energy to increase dramatically and no matter the consumption, it will not decrease. This allows them to fight without running out of energy almost indefinitely. It even works in Stopped World. It has Stampede, a self-defense mechanism where the user is taken over by Wrath, destroying everything in their wake. Another broken skill owned by Rimuru is Uriel, Lord of Oath. Its current users are Masayuki and Rimuru. It harvests Infinite Prison, which is the skill used by Chloe to seal Veldora. Law Manipulation, which allows the manipulation of laws from either a magical or physical perspective. Universal Barrier, which provides the perfect defense using a combination of multi-layer barrier and severing the space between the outside and inside the barrier. It can automatically protect the user without any need for their intent or awareness of an attack. Spatial Domination, which gives the user full control over the element of space. 
Absolute end which damages targets via the severing of space. The skill is so powerful it can even harm a true dragon. Lastly, it has Absolute Guard, which is an art derived from the application of Infinite Prison via the combination of Distortion Field and Uriel's Universal Barrier to achieve a nearly unbreakable guard against most attacks. Final slot, we have God of Space Time Yogg Sotahar, which is the ultimate skill of Chloe Albert. It's a unification of her Time Traveler with Usurper, which is Hinus's skill. This skill can steal power and abilities from opponents. Absolute End in Infinity Prison, which formed Lord of Space Time Yogg Sothoth, that was then combined with Serial, which has authority over life and cycle of reincarnation, and Michael, which I explained already, which transformed it into God of Space Time. Some honorable mentions are Belzebuth, which is super strong but isn't on the list because I put Azatoth, which is basically an evolution of it, Gabriel, which fixes something into place, locking them into a temporal stasis. Also, it has the ability to bring everything in the user's domain to an absolute halt, also nullifying all kinds of attacks. If you enjoyed this, consider watching another, subscribe, and let's try to hit 100 likes on this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one.